So I'll try not to wake these guys. They've been screaming for a couple of days now. Their mom rejects them. They are so tiny. They one of them fell asleep in my my hands. They are tiny, tiny. I don't know how old, but they just opened their eyes. I have an eye infection or something. So um, yeah, if you want to help me out on this, uh, you. I, there would be a link to my PayPal account. Uh, I'm going tomorrow over the mountains with these three crazy guys. Ooh, baby spider. Don't want spiders. Yeah, so they will sleep with me in the tent uh, in case because uh, they've been freezing. It's freezing here right now in the valley. I've been getting the cold myself because of it. And so their mama is too young, really. It must be her first lit. So now they are tired of screaming. They're also hungry, so tomorrow I'll cross the mountains. It's about one, two hour walk, depending on your speed. Um, it will be a rough ride because I have all the things to do as well. But, uh, you know, what well, heartless people would leave these guys innocent little, I don't know, the, they're just adorable, so look forward for you, I don't want to wake them up now because they're finally silent, so, ah, uh, well, there's my cutie, are you a cutie, <laughs> they're wonderful, but they're super tired, so let's hope they'll stick to being tired for the rest of the night. It's a very normal thing happening in San Pedro and many people have this mentality that it's nature, it's nature. Well, I'm nature too and I choose to help myself. So, yeah, uh, I need glasses for my eyes. I really don't see well in the nights anymore. I got started to, to make a very strange elf sock for my foot <laughs> experimentation. And because it's so cold, uh, so I have one sock over my wool sock. Here's my tapas. And here's my babies. So, yeah, it will be quite busy here in the days ahead. I'm trying to keep my tent bug free. It's quite a small tent, but uh, we'll manage. And these guys will glow up so we can see something. There will be a lot of work with washing the gear. I got some eggs from them. Tomorrow I'll buy a cat cage. Uh, whatever they need, whatever babies need, you know. I've been foster mom for a lot of cats. So the exercise tonight is goodbye. And it will be swapped with running over the mountains tomorrow, which is about three to four hour exercise. And uh, buying food for these little guys, keep them alive and make them into strong, independent San Pedro cats. Yeah. So, whatever it takes, uh, I'll do whatever it takes to keep them alive. For one month now, I will um, be responsible. Then I will. So, for those of you who want to help or adopt one of them, uh, you know, uh, get special drawings and postcards, you want, you want to name it, and something like that, we can talk about it later, um, and at some point we have to let them go, because the some pedal cards, you know, this is really kind of Darwinistic system here, a very few, uh, some cats are cuddly, most of them are skeptical, so... Yeah, this is San Pedro in the night. I'm going to go back to my tapas and uh, my spell work. Uh, in, ironically no, uh, you know, if I just uh, manifested a tulpa, you can read about them in the Tibetan Book of the Dead. And of course, it is a huge tiger. And in return, I get these. <laughs> So I have a protective tiger in as a thought form, and I have these three guys now that I have to protect. 
the boobs up. Uh, I hope they will be fine. They look pretty fine so far, and so well. Anyway, uh, if you can't, you know, is whatever you can help with, you know, moral support, advices, anything it will help. Uh, and uh, I will put up. Uh, receipts uh, to show what I actually use money for on them. I might have to sacrifice my glasses as I said and uh, yeah. So wish me luck with these three uh, buddies. Uh, you will see more of them. Pictures, everything, updates. And uh, I have to unfortunately to bring them with me because there are animals here who will eat them alive. And they say there is a Scorpio and the third and uh, the third rock. So uh, yeah, I have to bring them with me. I can't leave them alone. I'm a mighty cat. So yeah, thanks for today and uh, thank you for listening. This is uh, Mali from San Pedro from Wild Willow Tales. Please subscribe to my channel and. Uh, I hope uh, it will be more active eventually because I do experience a lot of crazy things which I haven't uploaded because of the lack of el um, electricity here. Thank you and goodbye. Ciao and out.